China has revealed a new invention that will completely change the space industry as we know it. Chinese company iSpace is working on and testing a new rocket called the Hyperbola 3 that might be a very serious competitor of SpaceX, and it will be ready soon. A giant amount of Chinese financial resources are poured for this purpose to create a new rocket that will dominate the space industry. And that's why China with iSpace is testing and working very hard for the development of this technology and with the mind-boggling innovations that Hyperbola 3 will have. It is very exciting. So let's explain how China revealed a new rocket that it is working on and how it will be ready soon. The Hyperbola 3 rocket, developed by Chinese space launch company iSpace, represents a significant step forward in China's burgeoning private space sector. Expected to be larger than Hyperbola 2, Hyperbola 3 will likely have increased payload capacity, enabling it to carry more significant payloads to orbit. It may utilize more advanced propulsion technology, incorporating liquid fuel engines for enhanced efficiency and performance. One of the most exciting and anticipated features with Hyperbola 3 might be reusable technology. Taking cues from SpaceX's successes with the Falcon 9, Hyperbola 3 might feature reusable first-stage boosters or other components, which would be a significant leap in reducing launch costs and increasing launch frequency. There were expectations that Hyperbola 3 might use more advanced propulsion systems, as already mentioned, possibly involving new types of fuel or engine designs that could offer higher efficiency and better performance. This could include innovations in liquid rocket engines or hybrid propulsion technologies. Amid growing concerns about environmental impact, there are reports about Hyperbola 3 might include eco-friendly design elements, such as less polluting fuels or manufacturing processes that reduce the rocket's environmental footprint. Advanced automation and state-of-the-art avionic systems probably will be incorporated as well to improve reliability and mission success rates. Hyperbola 3 is expected to surpass Hyperbola 2 in terms of payload capacity, range, and possibly orbital insertion accuracy. It will feature more sophisticated technology, including improved engines and materials, and advanced guidance and control systems. Hyperbola 3 will offer more cost-effective launch solutions. Of course, as the most dominant company in this area, SpaceX with its Falcon series, particularly the Falcon 9 and Falcon Heavy, has a well-established track record of reusability and heavy lift capabilities. Hyperbola 3 is expected to differ in specific technological aspects, such as propulsion technology, reusability approach, and payload integration. SpaceX's operational model includes a broad spectrum of services, from satellite launches to manned missions. Hyperbola 3, at least initially, will focus more narrowly on satellite deployment. Also, SpaceX has a global customer base, whereas Hyperbola 3 initially is expected to concentrate more on the domestic Chinese market or specific international partners. The development of Hyperbola 3 highlights China's growing capabilities in space technology and its ambition to become a significant player in the global space industry. Challenging established entities like SpaceX, the specifics of its capabilities and differences will become clearer as the project progresses towards its first launch. And it is interesting to point out that SpaceX in this regard is competing with the whole country because the Chinese government has shown significant interest in the development of rocket technology, a key component of its broader strategic goals in space exploration and commercialization. And this interest manifests in several ways. The Chinese government actively supports the space industry through funding and policy support. This includes investments in research and development of new technologies, infrastructure for space exploration, and supporting commercial space ventures. There is an increasing trend towards public-private partnerships in China's space sector. The government encourages private companies to engage in space activities, potentially offering them access to previously state-controlled resources and facilities. Part of the interest in rocket technology is driven by military and strategic considerations. Advancements in rocket technology have direct implications for national defense and security. Also, China aims to be a major player in the global space race, competing with the United States, Russia, and emerging private players. Developing advanced rocket technology is crucial for achieving this goal. The space sector is seen as a driver of economic growth and technological advancement. Success in this sector can propel China's status as a global leader in high-tech industries. And because of giant amount of financial investments and support from the government, there is a big competition in China in space industry. China Academy of Launch Vehicle Technology, CALT, and Shanghai Academy of Spaceflight Technology, SSAST. Traditional state-backed entities develop rockets like the Long March series. Other Chinese private space companies like Landspace, OneSpace, and Galactic Energy 
are also developing rockets with similar capabilities. So for sure, we can expect giant innovations, new rocket developments, and exciting innovations from China in near future. And that's it for today. Subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell.